Welcome back to another video. We're gonna be like a Star Wars set ideas video. It's gonna be for UCS sets. I know I've done a little, a uh, little bit of this in the past, kind of integrated into other sets or other videos. But today, that's gonna be my kind of thoughts on my top kind of three or five UCS sets that I feel they they should make. Um, of course, the ones for this year are already kind of rumored: the Cloud City and the um, uh, what's the other one? The Y Wing. Um, those are kind of rumored for this year. Um, but I feel like there's some other ones they should make soon, or maybe surprise us with, maybe May the 4th one. Um, the first one being an A-Wing. Uh, they have all the other Rebel kind of ships instead of an A-Wing. They've already made a Y-Wing, they have an X-Wing, they have a B-Wing. Where is the A-Wing? That's all I can say. Uh, I think that would be a very dope uh, kind of uh, you know set to build uh, for a UCS set. It wouldn't be as repetitive as some other uh, sets, I believe. I think because it's more uh, curvature, there's more sloping to it, more smoothness to it. I think it would be a pretty cool UCS set to you know build and pretty much come out really well um, if they ever try to do it so there's my number one pick number two guys would have to be a if they're not ever going to do a tie bomber or a tie interceptor again I would just make a UCS tie bomber I think that would be pretty cool a big tie bomber to kind of go with the tie fighter I think that would be very dope and uh you know something that you know, a lot of people would maybe grab, especially if it's like a smaller UCS set. If it's only like a $200 UCS set and looks very cool, like a bigger version of that, like kind of fake image that's been going around, I think that would sell a lot. If that was like a May the 4th one, um, that would look pretty cool. Uh, next up would be the First Order Supremacy, uh, one of those, uh, you know, higher up First Order Star Destroyers, either Snoke's ship or just the the Dreadnought or whatever, uh, yeah, I think they should definitely do that, I, especially Snoke's ship, you know, because I don't think they're ever going to do it now since it, it blew up pretty much and Snoke's not alive, uh, presumably, but if they were to do Snoke's ship, uh, it would be pretty cool, maybe come in at like 300 bucks, come with a bunch of minifigures, you know, uh, not be minifigure accurate as well or minifigure scale, but at least get the shaping done, uh, make it about the same scale as the UCS Star Destroyer, uh, something like that, or the Super Star Destroyer even. Um, because I feel like it would look almost like just two Super Star Destroyers kind of, uh, you know, angled and, uh, away from each other, so, I think that would definitely be an idea. Um, then of course I want to throw in the ideas like the gunship, turbo tank, and MTT and stuff, but... Quite honestly, I don't think those will ever come out, uh, but I do feel like one that is the highest possibility out of all of them is a UCS Venator, but again, a lot of that stuff, because the Clone Wars and the prequel era is, or era is kind of done right now, I don't think they would ever come out with that, but I believe the Venator is the number one uh, you know, set that could come out. And then one that I was actually pretty surprised they never came out with since they've come out with the Falcon a bunch of, or you know, twice I guess now, is the Ghost from Rebels. I'm surprised they never came out with the UCS version of that. I think that would be pretty dope. Uh, not dupe, but dope. Uh, that was actually very bad. But uh, yeah, I'm surprised they never came out with the Ghost uh, you know, UC UCS set. I think like 250 would be a good price range for that. Make it a bigger version. Uh, come with the entire Rebels crew. Uh, you know, maybe... Um, what, what's the dude's name? Uh, Callus, maybe the original Inquisitor again. Uh, throw him in for nostalgic purposes. Uh, but I think that's uh, pretty much, pretty much my top ideas. I would say my top three ideas that I really want right now that I'd probably grab right away would be an A-wing Venator and the Ghost. Um, even though I'm not the biggest Rebels guy, and of course the prequel stuff would all be in my top. I would get any of them, but uh, I don't feel like those are realistic one bit. So that's why those are not really on the list. I'm just trying to look around, uh, seeing what other sets that could be a possibility. Um, I don't really think there's much else that could be a thing aside from maybe a UCS uh, First Order Heavy Assault Walker soon. That would be kind of uh, cool. Or the uh, Cargo Shuttle or the ATM-6 Cargo Walker from Rogue One. Um, any of that stuff. I'm kind of surprised they never came out with those, but who knows, guys? UCS sets are all kind of up in the air. There's only a couple a year, you know, I think two or three, uh, three or four max, I think, a year they can come out with. So those are pretty much my thoughts. Leave your thoughts down below, guys. What are your uh, opinions on mine? I want to thank you guys all for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for more. See you guys later. Bye.